Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to my channel and today in this video I'm gonna show you how to fix Pokemon Legends Arceus from crashing in ESO emulator so let's get started as you can see guys I have user early access to 464 so I have uh, many solution of this problem so first of all you need uh, to update your user emulator and uh, I assure you uh, I have many uh, versions for user early access you can see guys uh, 2434 and 2436 you can try another version of user emulator if you are facing crashing problem for this game in views of okay so use latest version user emulator for this game so this is latest version user early access and uh, one more thing guys many people use amd gpu and they can face crashing issue for this game in user emulator so first of all i'll show you how to use amd gpu for this game in user emulator but before setting uh, you should have latest prod keys and latest firmware for this game in user so update your prod keys and uh, you have uh, latest uh, firmware for this game system You should have latest firmware. So I have already latest firmware for my this game and close it and uh, and uh, many people use OpenGL for this game but OpenGL has some bugs uh, for this game so you can face graphics glitches for this game uh, with the OpenGL but I recommend Vulkan then go to emulation configuration and uh, uh, go to graphics and select from here Vulkan and select GPU decoding and select 1x resolution and check this option advanced and uncheck this because we are using Vulkan okay so uncheck OpenGL only use VC and select normal from here go to CPU select auto and go to general and select multi curve and ok and go to the game properties and general and check this option multi core cpu auto graphics and guys there should be same setting for vulcan okay select vulcan and 1x resolution and uncheck it and select normal from here and if you want to use amd gpu for user emulator for this game configuration go to graphics so here is select AMD Super Resolution Vulkan only. Okay, these settings are for AMD GPU. Okay, but my GPU is NVIDIA G4 GTX. So I select from here this one. Okay, and uh, one more important thing, guys. Some people have some issues with Vulkan sometimes. GPU device does not show with Vulkan. And if you face this issue, then please update your drivers for your GPU, okay? After installing latest drivers for your GPU in your PC, you can fix this issue, okay? But I have latest version drivers from my GPU, so this is why my GPU device is working with Vulkan, okay? And you will have to do some more settings for your GPU. Right click go to control panel for NVIDIA or AMD Go to image setting with preview and Check this option select performance from here Right here and check it and apply and go to manage 3d settings scroll down and select from here power management mod maximum performance and scroll down and select from here texture filtering quality select high performance from here and click on apply and i show you my system information i'm using latest version drivers for my gpu and i have windows 10 pro directx run time version 12.0 and driver version 496.49 close it and i show you my pc specification and go to properties so i have processor intel or exxon cpu 3.20 gs 
and install memory RAM RGB. And guys, one more thing. Go to this PC and right click. Uh, sorry guys, right click and go to properties. Right click, go to properties. Go to device manager. And go to uh, display adapter. And if you are using multiple devices as a GPU in your PC, then disable one device from here if you are using multiple devices in your PC. And remember guys, you will have to disable low GPU device from here. Okay, don't disable powerful GPU from here. NVIDIA G4 GTX 750 is a powerful GPU. So disable GPU device from here, right click and click on disable device. But I don't disable my device because I have only one device as GPU in my PC. Okay, so I don't close it, close it, close it. And for more setting guys, uh, right click and remove uh, OpenGL pipeline catch. Delete it. Okay, right click and remove Vulkan pipeline catch. Yes. Okay, right click and remove all Python cats. Yeah, and restart your user emulator. Now, guys, you can play your game. So, as you can see, guys, game is working now. Hope you like this video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.